Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Welcome to my monthly highlights video for the month of June. I do have my little bestie here who wanted to be in my intro. You wanna say hi? Hi. You wanna wave? <laughs> so, that is my daughter. Um, do you wanna say, do you know what that says? Um, press, press. And what's that word? Marito. Good job. Okay, I'm gonna flip through. And I got the deco sidebar and the date numbers and things. So I'm gonna lay down the base and then the boxes and then I will do the days real time. You wanna say bye? Bye. See you in a minute. the daily section of this monthly thing so one I'm so freaking tired but my daughter has gymnastics in like 20 minutes so not 20 <laughs> like an hour but for the first I marked hello June so I did use this like pride icon for my sheets progressive pride heart and then hello did I say my sheet that's for my shop it's not in shop anymore it was only for June but the Hello June is also for my shop. And then this day I got a new chair and built it, which is what my butt is in right now. And this is a hammer from Whimsy, I think is what it's called now. And then this new chair script is from, it's in like the running to become a new font to replace font two and three. If you're part of my Facebook group, you know all about that and you probably voted, so. If not, go vote. Um, and then the second, let me mark it over here, was National Donut Day. So both of these things are from McPlans. And then I also had a double nap this day. Cause why not? Um, this bed is the messy bed for my shop. 
my daughter had a birthday party to go to this day. So this little party guy that I put on there wrong um, is from Stick With Plan Co. And then Grace's party is a script I made. And this is also the day that we finished watching A Million Little Things. This is another font that is um, in the running to replace font two or three. And then that TV's for my shop. On the 4th, it was National Cheese Day, and since I don't just have like a random slice of cheese, I'm using this bowl of mac and cheese, and these are both from McPlans, and this day I listened to a book called Something Blue, which is the sequel to Something Borrowed. And then on the 5th, I got my bumper estimate done. Which I still haven't even popped it out, but I don't think I'm going to get it fixed. I just need to pop it out. But this car is for my shop. And then this day is when it started being smoky from the wildfires. It was like really eerie outside. It was like yellow. So, yeah. This is from Once More With Love. And then I made the script. And ironically, we listened to Catching Fire this day, so the audiobook icon is from my shop. Then on the 7th, I again marked that it was smoky. This one has a smiley face. I did not mean to really pull that, but same thing. And this is the day that I actually, like, finalized my new fonts that I was um, bringing in for a poll. So the pig is from, like the pig on the laptop, it's actually from Gen Joy Sampler, but it's from McPlans. On the 8th, Joe and I had our first date in like 17 years, so that was exciting. Um, I do have this giant like date emoji thing from the Coffee Monsters Co. and then with my love script for my shop and font one. Um, on the 9th, we watched Spider-Man with my oldest, so I have this Spider-Man onesie girl from uh, Stick With Blanco, this With Bub script from Play With Me Stickers, and then Spider-Man Homecoming is from one of my bucket lists, like my um, Marvel Cinematic Universe bucket list. On this day, I only marked drinking red white and true which was not the best but the cherry was definitely the best um this seltzer can is from mcplans on the 11th i marked cuddling my guinea pig so that's from joy planning and then this is a script from my shop in font four um we had taco bell on the 12th clearly we had a very eventful day um the 13th, we booked our hotel for going to Buffalo, which we're going on Monday, so that's exciting. Both of those things are from my shop. The 14th was Flag Day, and this is from the Coffee Monsters Co., and the Flag Day script is from McPlans, and this is also the day that I sent my PR emails, so this is from the Coffee Monsters Co., and then the 15th, um, my son graduated fifth grade, which means that he's moving on to the elementary or the middle school. He's finished with elementary, but this girl is from Joy of Planning. And then this day we went to Barnes and Noble and got, I don't know, a bunch of junk. It wasn't really junk. I got some books for the kids and like Cards Against Humanity, the family version and some Pokemon cards, so, yeah. Um, this bag is actually from a old, like, um, my Black Friday She I might bring that to shop. And then the retail therapy is from my shop in Font 1. On the 16th, my son had a, like, kind of field trip to the middle school, so this pig with the backpack is from McPlans. And then we played Cards Against Humanity this day. So this is from Stick With Plan Co. And then the script I made, which that one's um, the third choice. Like font three, not font three, choice three from my poll. 
Um, and then I literally just mark listening to a book this day, which was called Play, and audiobooks from my shop. On the 18th, it was Father's Day, so I have this little cute thing from Stick with Plan Co. And then Father's Day script from Make Plans. And then we did do gifts with my husband, obviously, because it's Father's Day. This is an old icon for my shop. And then with Joe's script from, well, it's a custom for my shop in Font 4. And I got him a joke card that, like, it was a little bit of a fail. So it was like a prank. Once you open it, it, like, never stops talking. Oh, I mean, it stops in, like, I think it said three to six hours. So we were like, oh, pull the battery out. And when you, like, open the card to pull the battery out, glitter comes out. And thank God he's, like, a trooper because he kind of figured out that there was glitter in it. And ended up opening it all over himself, like, for the kids' enjoyment. So, yeah. That was cute. But my kids love pulling pranks. And then for Juneteenth, I have this icon from my pride sheet. And then Juneteenth script from McPlans. And then my kids had no school today, or that day. So, the pencil is from... My shop um they had their field day at school this day so i just have this strawberry heart from my anniversary like with my anniversary all order freebie and technically their field day should have been the sixth but they had to move it because of the smoke so or maybe it was the seventh i think it was yeah it was this wednesday but they moved it to down here because of the smoke so thankfully it was like a nice day out and this was actually their last full day of school so joe and i went and ran some errands to do some birthday shopping so i do have the shopping spree icon for my shop and then run errand script also for my shop and then the 21st was the first day of summer so i have this little summer vibes icon from stick with plan co the first day of summer script I made. And then Jude also went and got his hair cut. He's got the nicest hair. Like I've never used, I've never let anybody use like clippers on him. It's always scissored. I don't know why. I just, I don't want his hair buzzed. It's so nice. It's so thick. So nice. So this icon is from the Coffee Monsters Co. And then with Jude is from Play With Me Stickers. And then on the 22nd, the kids like the twins missed school because they had a dentist appointment let's go in frame so i do have this like tooth snowball from uh sweet it was paper and then with the twin script that i made and that font choice one um and then this day was the last day of school so the backpack is from my shop and then the script is from mcplans and I traded them to McDonald's for lunch. So we have this um, burger meal version two for my shop and then McDonald's script and font four for my shop. And then the day after all I marked was listening to a book again. <laughs> it's like what I do every weekend. Meh. Not every weekend, but most weekends. So audiobook again is from my shop. On the 25th, I actually played Dreamlight Valley, which is crazy. So, I think I actually played that the day before, too, but I didn't mark it, obviously. Um, both of these things are from my shop. This is the handheld game version 2. And then we started Mockingjay this day um, on the 26th. So, the book stack is book stack version 2 from my shop. On the 27th, this was... Angelia's birthday, so I have this birthday cake bear from my shop, and then I made the script, and my mom, yeah, mama drama happened, and both of these things are from my shop. On the 28th, I signed my daughter up for gymnastics, so I have this online shopping icon from my shop. It actually looks a little different now because the screen is not gray. But, yeah, she's had one um, session since signing her up. Today is her second one, which I said earlier 
Oh, this doesn't go here. I said earlier in the plan with me that, or thing that we're going to gymnastics in like an hour. I actually said 20 minutes, but it's been 14, so. Now I gotta let this dry. Okay. that's where that goes but this day I went through Amelia's closet and got rid of like smaller clothes or my girl is like so freaking clumsy so she's always getting stuff on her and like staining her clothes so throughout those clothes but this is from Leonard Signs and then this day I actually went to a brewery with my friend Karan so we'll both into Karan and then this is from McPlant and then when I got home, I annoyed my husband and made him watch per Pitch Perfect with me. Um, this is a popcorn bear from my shop. And then Pitch Perfect is in that font choice three. And then with Joe is custom in font four from my shop. That was kind of loud. But yeah, let me throw this in my... Whoa, that stuck to me. Right here. Hmm. Let me throw this in my planner and then I will be right back. Here is the finished spread. I'm not going to wiggle it like I usually do. This is also the sixth month in the year, which means that the first half of the year is completely done. Um, yeah, I haven't filmed that base, but that's it. And then everything that's left in the kit is that stuff, which I never really use. Is two things on here and then a few things on here. So, yeah. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you have not already, and I will see you next time. Bye!